Hey guys, welcome to another YouTube video. Today I'm gonna show you guys how to create this lovely virus emulator or simulator whatever on Scratch. I had already deleted the sprite cat, so we're going to find something on the internet. Yeah, so, so, um, so we can choose desktop instead because we need to choose a specific Windows version. Okay, that's what, that's not what I want to find, so we can start with Windows XP. Okay, so we get this. So we save it. Holy. Windows XP. Yep, 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 yep. Upload backdrop. So now we get the Windows XP backdrop. So we choose it and oh. And we have to size it a little bit. Yeah, now it's fine, but yeah, it just looks <laughs> a little bit weird, but yeah, that's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. And we create a Sprite called virus. So that's what we're going to. Sorry, that's the main idea of this. So yeah, thanks to this and. Yeah, go to. Error message generator and we create an error message. Oh, yeah, and error message. Sorry, we get an icon. So, there are many, many, many funny icons. So The bomb would be good, and get the title is blue bar, and we can get like something funny. Yeah, 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 yeah. Of course, we can choose another thing because this is funny pair with funny and. This is just an example. You can type everything or anything you want to in the error message generator. <laughs> I said done great. That's kind of funny. So the main purpose is trying to trying to make it fun. Oh no. And no. 
and this button no get it to gray so it cannot be gray. yes and virus of course virus well this is just like simple you didn't need to click anything something yeah save this image Mm-hmm. Mm. Upload Sprite. Yeah, just make it 100% size. It will be okay. It was very fun because the desktop size is same. <laughs> the font size is even smaller than the air message. So, yeah, so get a code when this clicked, because you just want it to stack, so we add an extension. This is the important part, but it's very simple. Add an extension pen, and so you add this, and... Um, just repeat it a whole bunch of times. Well, this is just a simple virus. I will show you the virus I make. Uh, yes, a little bit complicated, but it's easy. So set a time 200 times. And... Um... We're going to um, like next custom so it can stack. Then we use the function from the extension pen. This is stamp. And so I go to sound. I upload one so it's from C Windows Media um, Yes So this is the Windows 7 Stop sound. Yeah, kind of brave, so. I'm just making it funny. But <laughs> even this is a XP theme, it just. Mm, yeah. And we we'll wait. This is enough. Zero point two five seconds. Holding. What's the problem here? Um. Copy the whole thing and paint. Maybe. Yeah. That's not a good sign. So, this is kind of frustrating, and so we can change this to our own thing, which we draw a circle. We paint one. Yeah, of course you can paint one and get this to blue so it does more like windows and fill it with anyway I'm just Yeah. 
so that's more like Windows and we add and we just type in X get it to and we select it and we drag it to there so that's more like windows and we can say is crashed here and and we just like emulate the x sign the error thing yes and now we drag it right here Sorry, maybe it's a, a little bit too wide but it doesn't really matters because the main idea is for it to f make it fun i'm trying to make it fun so we have this and yeah um an error message error sorry i Yeah, just like a <laughs> bunch of random error codes. Yeah. Yeah, so see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go to random position. Yeah, just kind of like that. Then we can... We can smaller the timer. Ooh, no, definitely not that fast. Yes. <laughs> yeah, the virus is successful. Hack successful. I don't know when it will be stopping, but I'm very sure. I'm pretty sure that this is, yeah, very good sign. And so what we have. BSOD and I'm please screen of this at the end. That's going to be more fun. BSOD and that drops and upload the BS. And then we upload the BSOD. That was very good. Oh 
man. Yup, yup, yup. And we change the backdrop. Switch backdrop to BSOD. That was very simple. You can just like wait one second. And switch backdrop to Windows XP. Oh, nah. That does not make sense. Erase all. So I need to hide. So that just seems yeah, my computer wasn't attacked by a virus, so huh. Mm hmm does make sense. Oh no, I, I forgot to add an erase all to the end. Erase all. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of funny. Good for pranking your friends. Yeah, that would be perfect for pranking. One more thing, one more thing. And debug. Erase all and hide. <laughs> yes! This has successful. This was very successful. And I save the project. And I go to my stuff. And I already have one Windows XP virus on there. And now I can I'll I can show you this. This is just an emulator. Don't download the real virus on your own computer. <laughs> it, yeah, it may damage even. It may erase your BIOS, I think. Kind of 